Hey, what's going on everybody? My name is Zed the Insomniac and welcome back to Spyro A Hero's Tale. It is Christmas time. As you can tell, because I'm wearing my hat and got some Christmas presents behind me. It's also um, probably one of the last levels we'll do in the Winter Wonderland. Which is a bit of a shame because as far as like icy snow levels go, it's not that bad. It's not that bad at all. Now we get to take on the big baddie in the castle area. It actually looks really cool with the light coming out of it. Um, a couple episodes ago I completely forgot to talk about it much. Um, the Elder Dragon Astor, I think, talks about Spyro and his um, ADD, Attention Deficit Disorder, which I thought was really really interesting. Like it's um, yeah, it's interesting that they specify that he has ADD. It explains why he, you know, can't sit still and a lot of his personality in Spyro 1. I mean, they kind of branch off from that uh, approach with his personality in 2 and 3. And then they really bring it back and ramp it up in Hero's Tale. Right? He's very similar to how he was in the first one. It also explains why in game he has to constantly be torture everything, right? I know, I just thought it was kind of cool. Not believe this. Oh. How did you make it this far? No matter. I will deal with you now. I was hoping it wouldn't come to this, but alas, you have forced my hand. Am I supposed to be scared of you? I've spoken to the elders, and from what I can make out, you're just a traitorous coward. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Well then, prepare young dragon to be taught a lesson. I don't remember this battle being so early on. I thought it was later, but perhaps I'm just remembering that wrong. Oh dear. Ouchie wouchie. He's so arrogant, you know? He's so hot headed and he thinks he's like so cool. And he's really playing it down. He's like, I didn't think you would make it this far. It's like, well, then why did you oops, send out all those minions for you, big dummy dumb dumb? Like, he's, he's really playing it cool, isn't he? Ouch. Did that even hurt me? Nope. I mean, did that even hurt him? It just hurt, hurt me. Okay, cool. We got him twice. Oh my gosh, that was lucky. He shoot between one and two. I can't tell if he's gonna... There we go. I can't tell when he's gonna do two. There's no sign. I suppose one example of... Ow, Spyro's ADD in um, Spyro 2 is after you defeat Gulp for the first time. And, I don't know, so we'll just wait. Did we're better though, right? I just hope I fight better than you when I'm your age. Ha <laughs> ha, close to what I said. That's even better. Sick burns. Okay, alright. Oh, hello. Yeah, after you defeat Gulp, you know, he gets to sit down for a couple minutes and he, he rests. And he, like, falls asleep, and then two seconds later, Alora disappears and he wakes up again. And he's like, wait, where did Alora go? I have to go find her. It's like, bro, just sit down for, like, a minute. Give yourself half rest, but he can't, you know, he can't sit still, so. Also, I'm gonna die right now. I'm gonna die right now. I'm gonna have to do the whole thing again. Awesome. Love that for me. Oh no, I'm here. Okay. That's nice. Strange. Usually you have to do the whole thing again, but I suppose there's a bit of a step up. Oh, come on, that ice attack. Is so annoying. I. How? How am I supposed to know? <laughs> Uh -huh. I guess he just stop. So he does one, two, three? Yeah, he does do one, two, three. Okay, well that's a little bit easier than before. Okay, that did hit him. He jumped over it, are you kidding me? Ah! No, I still have to hit him three times, so I have to kill these guys, then dodge his ice attacks. 
and then hit him once out of the four options, or four times, with those um, explosives that have his name printed on them for some reason. That would be two, and then three, okay. Two again, what? Hold on, hold on. Hold on. This is going to be difficult. I need to pay attention. Get rid of all these stinky bow binkies. Oh, I only have to dodge the ice falling from the ceiling. Love that for myself. Oh, this is rough. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh, maybe I just got this. Maybe that's actually a lot easier. Yeah, that was... I guess once you figure it out, it's not so bad. Come on, get him! What? Oh, you're kidding. But I only hit him once then as well. I wasn't really looking at the health bar. I was just mostly focusing on, ouch, not getting exploded or burnt okay this is actually not so bad I don't know why it's complaining so much nice ah and it hits me too oh no he did hit him again okay cool sweet we're good Infinite power, eh? Another Star Wars reference. Oh gosh, this looks different. And there's those electrical units. And the ice is melting. Brilliant. I just noticed his um elbows. Got, like a little blue scaly flare going on. Got a hell oh my goodness, hello. Run, 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 run. <laughs> I think he's catching up. What is he doing? Oh uh, yeah, he didn't catch up. Oh I see, he was Oh, no way. Re, um, covering the ground. Oh, I remember this. Right. I do too. Okay, cool. I can, like, jump in between them. Even though it doesn't look like it. That's weird. Uh, I, yeah, I knew it. I thought he was going to do that. I'm going to die. Wow. That was minimal effort. There's so much going on in this fight. It's crazy. Okay, so he mounts the surface we're standing on. Brilliant. He just circles me for a minute. What are you doing? Are you trying to attack me? Yeah, he is. Okay. Can I? Oh, I can too. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, that, that's nice. That's easy. I was going to say, it's not a, a sharp projectile, so maybe I can just cover my wings. Ooh, that was lucky. Now we're going again. Right, this way this time. I have to do this at least twice. Ah, oh, come on. Seriously? How did you get me? Bro. You're joking. Okay. If I can get him twice at least with his explosives this time, we might have a chance. Or maybe I can just get him all at once. Oh, but there's only three this time. And I didn't even touch him. Okay, we have to get him twice. I can hit two. That's good. I just actually have to do it. You want to breathe fire? No? You just want to look at me all menacingly. Okay, these first two bits are pretty... I've got no health though. <sighs> and now you're gonna do that. Ow! It's so hard to get ready for it. It's gonna start. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, now it's time for this.
Just little steps. Just little steps. Oh my gosh, it goes for so long. I was gonna say, don't get hurt yourself. Yes, we did it. Oh my gosh. Let's go. Again. Well, looks like your power wasn't so infinite after all. Infinite after all. Is it? Oh wait, I can't get up there. He left a staff behind. Spyro, thank you for releasing me. Why? I will now enchant you with the power of ice breath. All right. The ledger, huh? Ice breath can be used to freeze enemies and stop them in their tracks. It can also be used to freeze small water jets or cool down hot geysers. Cool. So we have all the powers now. Very nice. Very nice. That's gonna come in handy big time. We can go back to the underwater deep down darkness and cool down those uh, vents. Oh, and we can freeze these what events? Cool. That is really cool. Oh my goodness. I was gonna say, you're gonna make it, right? <laughs> Wait, is there, you can go back? I don't think you need to, but... Change it, you can. Yeah, I don't think you need to. Oh, it only goes for a little while, though. Alright. Ah! Oh! Died anyway, that was silly. Cool. Well... It's nice to get a uh, ice breath ability for Christmas. Hooray! We got a gift from a fairy. Best Christmas ever. I certainly thought so. Let me just double check that. I don't want to be wrong. Yeah, I don't think you can go anywhere. But seriously, why? What is the point? There is no point. It's just something you can do. Hmm. I'm supposed to, supposed to jump back and then jump forward. Maybe you're not supposed to be able to make that. Oh, what the? Again, really? I managed to like freeze it mid-air, the first one, and attach myself to it, but I couldn't freeze this one and then in a, a second jump attach myself onto it, of course. Of course not. Why, why would I be able to do that? Still, I can't believe we defeated Red. Um... With relative ease, I feel like I did a pretty good job of that. All things considered, that was difficult. Yeah. Well, obviously we're gonna have to fight him again. The next time it's gonna be much harder, which is where I stopped playing because I just couldn't do it when I was a, a kid. When I was a, a wee pop of smoke, I just couldn't do it. But I can do this. Oh yeah. And we can press down on the D-pad for... So we got up for electricity, down for ice, left for fire, and right for water. Strange. I thought up... I really thought up would be fire. But no matter. We really fell down, didn't we? We went quite the ways down this giant um, fort. Am I supposed to go this way? Hello, open up, please. What? Uh, excuse me? Can I please get out of here? I'm so confused. What? Oh, is that the way we came and then we go this way instead? I... What? I... They get turned around somehow. <laughs> Alright, okay. That was bizarre, but sure. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's hop in here and go to the next place. Hmm. Where do we want to go? Ooh, the Volcanic Isle. <gasps> we could go there. Actually, we will go there. I just want to check it out. We're not going to do much here or anything here because I want to go back and collect everything. There he is. 
bum but oh of course it's there isn't a volcano naturally Spyro I've got an idea where Ring might be mm -hmm. I believe he has a secret underground lair somewhere on this realm I'm going there in a while with my new gadget yes I being a mole will dig my way down to Red's lair. Meanwhile, see if you can find a way into the volcano. So he thinks it's underground in the volcano. And he's gonna go the, there himself. Professor, I don't think that's a good idea. He's gonna take take him on. But what technology? Is it a, a vaporizing ray? This is cool. I didn't remember it being a like a, a, a shore town volcano island place. Pretty nifty. Funky, funky. It sure is a harbor. That's the word I was looking for. A harbor. Oh, hello, hello. You got anything new for me? Ah, Except are, for ice missiles. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's actually quite expensive. Ah, there you are, my oh, that's a thousand. That's seven fifty. Sure, I'm gonna buy some of those. Why not? I'm gonna have some fun with some ice missiles. Hello, I hear a thief. I know I didn't say I was gonna do much here, but someone is taunting me right now, and they will pay for it. Hello. Someone here. He is eluding me. He's nearby though. Is he on the ground? Oh, I fell. Ah, there you are. Wait, let's check out my new ice missile. Okay. That's pretty underwhelming. I missed him. Seriously, I can't even hit him with this? I just wasted all my ice missiles. You're joking. This thief is also so slow. Look at this dude. I seem to be quite slow as I'll come here. You're on the naughty list, my friend, and that means death. Death and cold. Not necessarily in that order. Thank you. Alright, I'm gonna leave the episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We kicked Reds behind, grabbed him by the tail, and then threw him out of office. It was pretty awesome. If you enjoyed this episode, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and as always, I'll see you on the next episode that I make. Until then, have a good day, have a good night. Bye bye.